Hi, I'm Tim Dennis with Invisible Towers, and I would like to thank the Loudoun County Chamber of Commerce for considering our business for the Small Business of the Year Technology Award. If you look up at the clock tower, basically from that level where the lights are sitting with the green horizontal band, everything up, that becomes a telecom tower at that point. All of that is a uh, surface in which antennas can be installed for transmission operation. Structural steel is contained behind that, the antennas are contained behind it. In that surface area up there that is the clock face, you'll actually have all four of the major carriers in the market, Clear, or excuse me, Singular, T-Mobile, Verizon, and Sprint Nextel, all contained up in that uh, aperture. For instance, the power is already connected all the way down to the meter, so when a carrier comes to install, all they have to do is start right at that conduit and extend it to their shelter. Uh, we've created a ladder system on the wall to support the conduits, their transmission line, Everything's ready at the site, uh, meeting telecom standards, grounding is installed, telecom conduits are installed over here on this wall. So the telecom, uh, for, their, for their connectivity, uh, everything's already installed, the grounding's in place as I said. If you look across the roof, you can see what we've done is when the building was built, we teamed up with the building owner and pre-designed the steel and the capacity in the building to support the installation of their equipment buildings. Verizon will start their installation on this first set of piers in the next week or two. Singular will be going up on that upper left corner up there. They're starting their installation in the next week to 10 days. And uh, Nextel will go up in the front and then we'll still have an expansion slot. The T-Mobile installation, they have their platform already set in place. The transmission lines go on that ladder system. Everything's supported. There's nothing on the roof to impact the long-term viability of the building. Uh, everything's structurally designed to be supported by the building itself. And uh, so we've you know, pre-designed the building to support the weight and the loads created by the site. Thanks again for considering us and good luck making a decision. I know there's lots of competition. Have a great day.